Hello, here is Dinar and you are watching the Video Digest in which we cover the most important events in the history of the string transport development in the Skyworld community company over the past weeks. In this release, String Technologies Testing Center in Sharjah welcomed officials and entrepreneurs from Brazil. The company developer of the string transport has carried out tests of the new door system. The media resource World Construction Today has published an article about the string transport. Let's start with news from the United Arab Emirates. String Technologies Testing Center in Sharjah welcomed officials and entrepreneurs from Brazil. By the way, it is already the third delegation from this country. The main part of the tour was a ride on certified tropical unicar on the 400-meter track. While the queue was waiting for boarding, the guests were told about the types of rail string track structure, the features of different transport models and safety for passengers. In addition to the passenger solutions, the visitors got to know about the technical capabilities of Unicond, which is designed to transport 20-foot and 40-foot sea containers. The representatives of Carahas and Mine were particularly interested in Unicond. It is one of the largest ore deposits in the world. During the tour, the guests also saw the dispatch room and visited the demonstration pavilion featuring a high-speed transport model that can reach speeds of up to 500 km per hour on intercity and international roads. We remind you that previously among the guests of the testing center, there has already been the first Brazilian cosmonaut and the participants of the transport mission from this country. The meeting with a new delegation has again indicated a growing interest in the string transport technology. And we move on to the next news. Let's move from the United Arab Emirates to Belarus. The company developer of the string transport has tested the sliding reclining doors. To do this, the specialists simulated situations in which an object gets stuck between the flaps. Being jammed by doors remains one of the most common causes of injury on public transport. To solve this problem, the company has created an in-house system that allows passengers to board and deboard the transport means safely. The new doors are equipped with sensors with which the intelligent transport system can monitor the station environment and detect obstacles. This ensures that touching the flaps is minimal so as not to cause any harm to the person or their property. For example, if you put your palm, bag or mobile phone between the flaps, everything remains intact when the doors are closed. But if you do the same experiment in the metro, the damage is unlikely to be avoided. It is details like this that make the string transport the most efficient and safest way to travel. A new article about the project has been published on the media resource World Construction Today. The author of the publication compared the development of the string transport with the development of traditional transport systems. The journalist gave several examples from history when people did not believe in the success of personal transport, air travel and high-speed railways. Over time, however, these models of transport have become an integral part of modern logistics. According to the author, the same future awaits the string transport. At first, many people were skeptical about the project, but within seven years, the string transport company has created 12 working models and started building the testing centers in the UAE in Belarus, where anyone can test the technology in practice. Today, the project continues to develop. By 2025, the company plans to build a high-speed string track and test the transport at speeds of up to 500 km per hour on it. Negotiations are already underway to allocate a suitable plot of land. You can read the original article at the link in the description to this video. That has been all the news for today. Subscribe to the SWC YouTube channel and enable notifications not to miss the next news releases of the Video Digest. See you later!